grow is based on the premise that our kids are smarter and safer than our culture gives them credit for. And I can't tell you how many times I've said to myself in the past, you know, I did this. Why can't he do this? And then it dawned on me. I had that. Yeah. <laughs> it's not going to devastate him to hear that I could do this and you can't. It's going to make him think you could do this. So could I. There are a lot of kids who are having a hard time dealing with the everyday problems. Kids were having very little independence, autonomy. Let Grow has something called the Let Grow Project. Staten Island is going to do the Let Grow Project. Schools do the Let Grow Project. Parents can do the Let Grow Project. And here it is. It's a homework assignment. Mom, look, here's my homework assignment. It says I have to go home, here I am, and do something new on my own without you. And the reason that this is such an important, even though it's simple initiative, is that it's really hard to step back, especially if everybody's telling you to always hover. But if your school tells you, or perhaps Staten Island parent tells you, it's better to step back, try it once, then you do. I've heard from so many parents that their kids now are doing things like cleaning up after themselves, they're making their own breakfast, they're setting their own alarm for their online classes. It's just been such a terrific opportunity for uh, kids to really just gain that independence. As we're doing the project with you on Staten Island, where you let your kid do one of the Let Grow projects, whatever you choose, and then you take a picture of them, not following them the whole time, because that sort of defeats the purpose. And then you post it on social media with the hashtag, I I can't wait to see pictures of your kids doing all sorts of new things on their own. And you're going to be very proud to share those pictures, believe me.